Welcome everyone. In this video, we are going to see how we can use Atom Editor in order to write your HTML and CSS code. So first of all, uh, I'll be showing this for Windows only. So first of all, we need to download Atom. So just write down download Atom for Windows. Click there. So you can see this link. Click on there. So here you will have to click on download. So let it get downloaded. So once it gets downloaded, you need to click here. So let me show you what to do next. Just wait for 12 seconds. So it's done. Here you can see it's done. So after it's downloaded completely, you can see this green color. So click there. So when you click on that one, this one will automatically get installed. So you can see here Atom is being installed. So once it is done, it will be launched. So once you have uh, installed Atom, so you can either see this type of uh, welcome page or there will be uh, another welcome page where in this on the right hand side you can see some uh, icons here. So there uh, it will be written install a package. So you need to click on the install a package if you see a different screen uh, other than this. Or otherwise if you see a screen like this you can go to package and then just click on setting view and then go to install packages or themes so you will see something like this so in order to run your html code you we need to install some packages we need something called pigments okay so pigments this one you can see we need to install or we can install this one also we can either go for this or this one. We will go for this one. Next, we are going to uh, install auto save on change. You see this one? This one we need to install. Then, okay, next we need to install Atom Live server. So you can see this one installed. So uh, you need to install this package also which is MF, e -M -M -E, if you press right like this, you will, you go down, you can see this one, I have already installed it, so you need to click here, uh, some install button will become like this, so you will need to install MF. Now if you want to increase the font size of whatever you will be typing, you just need to go to file then click on settings you will see this one so go to editor so here you can see this is the font size so whatever size you want to give i'll give it as 26 okay here we have given the font size as 26 and i'll just click on one more thing go down so here soft wrap i'll just make it thick okay that's it so now we can uh, go and see how we can write a program so first of all we will just go to file and then click on new file okay so before that you need to find a location where you will be storing all your files okay html files so you just create wherever you want let us create one um, folder here itself web design so i have created a folder here so all my files will be saved here first of all here so the, here i'll be writing my code so first of all let us save this file so I'll just go save. You can press Control S also. So uh, on desktop, I have created the uh, folder web design. So here you can give any name you want. Let us give it as x index dot html. Okay. Just click save. Okay. So this is the html file we have created. Now so this is my index dot html. So now I will see uh, say how we can create the html file like automatically it is going to come because of the emit package just write exclamation mark and press tab 
so automatically the framework has been set up so here we can start writing uh, the html code so uh, this will come by default so let us make some modify some the code here let it be my web page and inside body let us write uh, welcome that's it so rest of the things are as it is just save it now now if you want to see the web web page that we have created we will go inside the folder this is the folder that we have where we have uh, saved our file double click here so you can see this is the page this is the title we have written my web page and this is welcome we have written inside the body so this is our first html page that we have created thank you for watching